家己知咩？何在去？即大家被白唔认嘅心，咱要开始今日嘅崇拜会，四篇第三十四篇三到四，恁甲我着称亚和华为大，一同高举伊嘅名。我祈求亚和华，伊就应允我，叫我脱离了。一切惊吓
三个祈祷，特别上帝，你是听我们阿爸的，你是掌管一切的上帝，管天地，那个你的命在。感谢你，多阮一摆的机会来到这，我罗赞美你，因为阮那无你的同在，阮是无办法同去做什么，阮需要你主啊，特别是对这个。大疫情现在，你到阮看见，你依然是坐伫宝座顶，依然是掌管
救助，唔哩连绵。所以，今日每一滴的需要，衬托的大人的心焦，阻止这个疫情的扩散，耶稣基督，感谢你每一滴，你都保守我，用你的保护，困实困。无托敌人有徛卡的机会，感谢主，有舒稳的力量。在这个困难的时期，我依然能徛得在。咱为敌诶，被听诶，兄弟姊妹，祈求得到医疗。主，你是上伟大的医生。我是你所创造的，你知影我的需要，求助、怜悯、求速度性得到一定。同时，我又为失去亲人的，求助的亲子安慰人，七大因的目屎，咱又为坏的失去工作。也是生理的人，祈求主，你需要知识、智慧，帮助因，当昨日恢复的正常。感谢主的同在，感谢主的听闻的祈祷，圣灵啊，求你运行在阮中间，保守牧师的喙子，开阮的心灵。大滚汤，滴一滴，今日你速度稳的信息，大滚汤，我做基督的形象，大滚，国家亲像耶稣基督，汤为最最坚强，我那尼基督感恩是奉主耶稣基督的名，祈求阿门阿门。今日信息嘅主题是无限嘅宽恕，上帝知影嘅宽恕人嘅一切，记载伫罗马字第五章第六到第十节，咱三甲来读。因咱也过乱了嘅时阵，基督就按所定嘅日期为罪人死。为伊人死的是小恶的，为伊人死的坎在有加做。独独基督伫咱，也阁是做罪人的时阵，为人死。上帝听，就直接向咱显明咯。现在，咱既然可得伊的血，情义就阁要吃到伊，免去上帝愤怒，因为。咱做受得嘅时阵，食着上帝惊嘅事，谈及上帝好好，既然好好，就国家要因为伊嘅话得救。咱今日的讲完是八十多，几乎完结了。咱现时从这点钟高度，八十多完结了。Good morning, brothers and sisters. Uh, welcome to our online worship service this particular Sunday. Ah, young people, how are you? Come here to the Monday, and let's get our work. Get some idea. We bang in, like hot side too. Our topic for this Sunday is all about God's unlimited forgiveness. In our little kingdom, we talk about the God's unlimited forgiveness. This is a very important topic since, as Christians. We are called by God not only to worship Him but also to serve Him. Ah, this is a very important topic. Ah, because we are not only to worship God, we are also to serve Him. Ah, this is a very important topic. Ah, because we are not only to worship God, we are also to serve Him. Ah, this is a very important topic. Ah, because we are not only to worship God, we are also to serve Him. Ah, this is a very important topic. Ah, because we are not only to worship God. 对咱的宽恕的时阵，咱国家的面格性对咱来讲是更加好诶。You see, forgiveness is one of the teachings of Jesus that we need to understand, accept, and appropriate if we are to become the person that God wants us to be 
and to do what God wants us to do and to live life the way God wants us to live it. So, if we are going to do what God wants us to do and to live life the way God wants us to live it. So, if we are going to do what God wants us to do and to live life the way God wants us to live it, we should be able to do what God wants us to do and to live life the way God wants us to live it. So, if we are going to do what God wants us to do But the sad reality is, because we oftentimes fail to forgive, we create so many limitations in ministry. For example, we limit our potential as Christians by not forgiving. Ah, 有时阵伫咱有法通做诶即个潜力伫内面，咱该限制。Many times God wants to expand our ministry, but when we fail to forgive, we limit what we can do for God. Ah, 真侪时阵，上帝爱帮助咱底下来扩大咱的时间，但是当咱无法能宽恕人的时阵，咱就无法能得到一款。We not only limit our potential, but we also limit our ministries by not forgiving. Ah, lam si tan tan ah lai han ce lan ni cham lat ha tang si ni lan as yok sok kau lan ni su kang. You can easily tell if a person does not want to forgive. Di tige lang na bo wan i kwan su lang ni si zun di ya kin ju e kwan zu. Because when we do not forgive, we become selective of what we do, who we minister to. And who we minister with. Ah, because when we are not willing to forgive people, we are not willing to do our work. 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 And add to that the depletion of spiritual empowerment caused by our disobedience. Then our, this, ah, shocking the concept starts here. Because we don't believe in the law of the land, it starts to be depleted. So we limit our potential by not forgiving. We limit our ministries by not forgiving. And thirdly. We become inconsistent with the message of reconciliation if we fail to forgive. So, when we are not forgiving, we are not forgiving. 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 Ah, guan yong kap diao su xin xiao. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. So if we fail to forgive, we go against the very core of the gospel. Ah, sometimes we do not want to work with another person. We're stuck with personal issues. Ah, 今有时阵可能是咱咧对一个人，咱生气一个人，也或者是讲咱无愿意甲一个人撒个同感。And by being stuck on personal issues, we fail to see the bigger picture, which is all about God's plan. 当咱开始聚焦伫咱个人的代志时阵，咱就袂看到上帝整个。When we fixate on personal issues, we become blind or insensitive to God's plan and agenda. So, if we don't pay attention to our own personal issues, we don't pay attention to God's plan and agenda. So, this afternoon, we will talk about God's forgiveness. So, this afternoon, this morning, we will talk about God's forgiveness because we want to understand that forgiveness. We want to experience it more and be able to express it more. Ah, kinalit lang may kong kaw si Yong Tae Kwan Su. Ini dan di start lai diao kai, lang ko ka biang piap, lang ko ka wat ang lai ah ani lai choi. As I said earlier, it's not only important to understand God's forgiveness, but we also have to express it. Ah, si tan tan dan di biang piap Yong Tae ho tuilan e Kwan Su lang yasit yu wat ang iya. 
来表现出来。So I hope that you would keep that in mind as we continue with the message this morning。所以我爱咱就将这两项代志记掉咧，等咱继续来讲到今仔日的信息。One important question that we need to ask and we will try to answer in this sermon is how can God forgive anyone for anything？ 啊，咱有一个真重要的问题，爱直接来探讨，并且还得到答案的，就是讲说。啊，要怎啊？上帝有法当啊，赦免啊，大家人诶，凊彩一个人，为着伊所做任何一件代志。To answer this question, we need to understand two very important theological concepts。咱要解答这个问题，咱需要明白两个真重要神学诶。Uh, the first one is propitiation. The word propitiation carries the basic idea of appeasement or satisfaction, especially toward God. It is a two-part act that involves appeasing the wrath of an offended person and being reconciled to him. Ah, this is the meaning of the two parts. The first part is to appease the wrath of an offended person and being reconciled to him. Ah, this is the meaning of the two parts. The second part is to appease the wrath of an offended person and being reconciled to him. Ah, this is the meaning of the two parts. The Bible teaches that God Himself has provided the only means through which His wrath can be appeased and sinful man can be reconciled to Him. 圣经假使咱甲人讲，只要上帝本身啊提供了一个唯一的方法，予咱有法当对伊的愤怒来啊讨好，来和和和解啊和解，然后予每一个有罪的人有法当搁一摆。There is no service, sacrifice, or gift that man can offer that will appease the holy wrath of God or satisfy His perfect justice. No one can offer to us a sacrifice, a gift, or a service that will appease the holy wrath of God or satisfy His perfect justice. So the only satisfaction or propitiation that could be acceptable to God and that could reconcile man to Him had to be made by God. So in the only satisfaction or propitiation that could be acceptable to God and that could reconcile man to Him had to be made by God. So in the only satisfaction or propitiation that could be acceptable to God and that could reconcile man to Him had to be made by God. Other concept that we need to understand is justification. Basically, justification is God's declaring those who receive Christ to be righteous based on Christ's righteousness being imputed to the accounts of those who receive Christ. Because of what Jesus has done, every time God looks at us, He sees Jesus' righteousness in us. So we are justified or declared righteous at the moment of our salvation. So our righteousness comes from placing our faith in the finished work of Jesus Christ. The sacrifice of Jesus covers our sin, allowing God to see us as perfect and unblemished. So as believers, God sees Christ's own righteousness when He looks at us. So He then says, "Give me your righteousness." 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 
诶，这个公义来加看。So the passage we will consider this morning is taken from the book of Romans. 所以今早起咱咧看，啊，对，啊，在经文是记载伫个啊罗马书。And in Romans chapter five, he talks about the blessings of our justification. 所以伫罗马第五章，伊讲到咱称义。Because of the sacrifice of Jesus, this is what we gain. In the Yasuo Kido, we learn so he sing it. Learn Jiao Hang to Jia Lai Di Diu. This is the Yi. In verse one of Romans chapter five, we experience peace with God. Ah, the Roman Shu E Go Chun Tao Zhi Zhat. Learn a King Liang Di Shi Gap Xiong Di E Ho Ho. The Bible clearly tells us that as sinners, we are God's enemies. So, the Bible clearly tells us that as sinners, we are God's enemies. So, the Bible clearly tells us that as sinners, we are God's enemies. But because of what Jesus has done, now we have peace with God. But is it that Yahshua did not bring us joy? That is, 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 If you look at worship in the Old Testament and even in the New Testament, you will understand that it's all about access to God. So, if we look at the Old Testament, the Old Testament, and even the New Testament, you will understand that it's all about access to God. So, if we look at the Old Testament, the Old Testament, and even in the New Testament, you will understand that it's all about access to God. So, if we look at the Old Testament, the Old Testament, and even in the New Testament, you will understand that it's all about access to God. So, if we look at the Old Testament, the Old Testament, and even in the New Testament, you will understand that it's all about access to God. 死的时阵，啊，这个奇妙代志发生，就是圣殿内面的这个万字列做两半。And that veil is not any ordinary veil。也唔是这个普通的这个啊啊万字。That veil basically separates the very presence of God in the holy of holies to the other portions of the temple。啊，这个万字就是将这个上帝主啊徛起的所在，就是。So when the veil was torn apart, what the Bible is telling us is now we can come to the presence of God because of Jesus Christ. So when the veil was torn apart, what the Bible is telling us is now we can come to the presence of God because of Jesus Christ. So when the veil was torn apart, what the Bible is telling us is now we can come to the presence of God because of Jesus Christ. So when the veil was torn apart, what the Bible is telling us is now we can come to the presence of God because of Jesus Christ. So when the veil was torn apart, what the Bible is telling us is now we can come to the presence of God because of Jesus Christ. So when the veil was torn apart, what the Bible is telling us is now we can come to The third blessing of our justification is a glorious hope. A sa a hope is to see in yao a pan mo. You see, as sinners, we do not deserve heaven. In Zaya Gong, the Zui Lin to mo mo a ti ge hang jin di tian gong. But because of what Jesus has done, we look forward to our eternal abode, and that is no other than heaven. But is in Ya So Ki Do Gui Lan So Zui Ni Lan Ju Ji Ge Pan Mo Ji Ni Tang Be Lai Gao Ji Ge Ying Ying. The fourth blessing of our justification is Christian character. You see, even though as Christians we still experience persecutions and hardships, but always remember that because of Jesus Christ, they always come with a purpose. So God is using all the trials, problems, and tribulations that we are experiencing to develop our character. So God is using all the trials, problems, and tribulations that we are experiencing to develop our character. For us to understand this, we must see the different views on religion. The basic meaning of the word religion is reconnecting with God. Ah, 当咱讲到宗教，即你你个时阵，第一重要就是讲说，诶，伊个解释就是讲甲上帝，佮一摆建立关系。Although the meaning is very simple, but man has different ways of understanding this. 虽然看起来即个啊解释应该是真正简单，但是人却用了真侪无相关的方法来做一个来解释。A lot of people are given to hopelessness simply because they think that salvation is all about what they do for God. 啊，真侪人啊，伫这个宗教甲咧追求啊，宗教的顶面啊，因感觉真正失望，因为因所想的，因认为说讲是看人
cuma lai cuy. People who have this concept usually think that it's impossible to reconnect with God. So, you think when you go to the land, 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 So for some, they think that we can reconnect with God through man's effort. Ah, so you just go along in the music concert. Then when I got strong, they can be one he just the long a a a la job. But this is not what the Bible teaches. Because if we base our reconnection with God through man's effort, then definitely it's impossible. And in it, and let me jump. Tak siang tak kian di kuan he, ini yang tai chi, ini yang cut lat ni, pang di lang di sini cuma si cun, ini si boh kau dia ni. But it is possible to reconnect with God when you see the other model for reconnecting with God. Dan si tenan, ah, bet, ah, tak siang tak kian di kuan he, si cun, ini yang yang wah cik boh siak si cun. A very familiar passage, John three sixteen, explains it to us. A portion of that passage says, "For God so loved the world." So it is impossible for man to do anything to reach God, but it is possible to reach God to reconnect with God because God made a way for us. So it is number. So reconnecting with God through human effort is impossible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us. Reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross for us, reconnecting with God is possible. But because God made a way by giving His Son Jesus Christ to die on the cross Himself. I would like to read three passages from the book of Romans, and we will study them one by one. The first one is Romans chapter five, verse six. The passage tells us when we were utterly helpless, Christ came at just the right time and died for us. So he comes at the end. Now, God wants to see you now. He took you until so tired that he will be very long, very dizzy. Notice that there is emphasis on that portion that says we were utterly helpless. Ah, you see, when the Lord took you out, how can you come at the end? Now, God wants to see you now. He took you. What the Bible means when it says that we were utterly helpless is that we are unable to provide salvation for ourselves. So it was at that moment of humility that Christ came at just the right time to die for our sins. Romans five eight says, "But God showed His great love for us by sending Christ to die for us while we were still sinners." Ah, pwede pwede sa konsep ng doki doki lang yung kuya kuya din na si Chun Wilan si Chong Te Tian si Tia Eng Lai Hien Mian Liao. So notice in verse six it says, "When we were utterly helpless," and in verse eight it says, "While we were still sinners." So ini kau di lama tu si Chong Te Lan buang dia ke si Chun. Ah, tapi pwede sa kyo Chong Te Lan tengah kuya 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 din na si Chun. You see, for a lot of people, they try to deserve the love of God. Ah, sin Chun Lan in ah. Some people think that after I become victorious with this particular sin, and then probably I will be acceptable before the Lord. In fact, I have encountered this particular 
mindset many times in my Bible studies. There are people who will tell me, we will join later on when we are good enough to join. So in their thinking, in their present condition, they cannot approach God. And in their thinking, they have to still do a lot of good works for them to deserve the right to come before the presence of God. But the Bible clearly tells us that while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Romans chapter 5 verse 10 says, For since our friendship with God was restored by the death of His Son, while we were still His enemies, we will certainly be saved through the life of His Son. So in Romans chapter 5 verse 6, it says when we were utterly helpless. In 5 verse 8, it says when we were still sinners. In verse 10, it says when we were still his enemies. So those three descriptions show us the inability of man to save himself. Well, this truth can lead us to two ends. One, you may think that you are hopeless because you are unable to save yourself. The other one is that it will make you look for another source of salvation other than yourself. I believe that the more we understand our inability, the better we can see what Christ has done for us. The more we see that we do not deserve salvation and we cannot earn it by our own works, the more we look for a source of salvation that is sufficient. So on our own effort, we are uh, hopeless, but because of what Christ has done, there is still hope. So this leads us now to point number two, the ability of God to save us. So when we were ungodly and without strength, yet Christ died for us. We were sinners, yet God demonstrated His love for us. We were enemies, yet God reconciled us and saved us. You see, the reason for the hope that we have is because of what Jesus Christ has done. If you think of salvation and think of man's condition, then you will understand that we cannot really save ourselves. But if you understand the character of God and see the works of Christ, then you understand that there is still hope. You see, the ability of God to save us comes from the fact that God is love. 
就是因为上帝本身是听。But we have to understand the role of love in salvation。但是你得了解讲说，这个听啊，对这个。啊，救恩的来临的角色是什么 ？The verse I mentioned earlier is a very important verse to understand this。啊，咱昨晚所读到的这经经文是对这个啊，应该真正的啊，会发达了解的这个经文。John three sixteen says, "For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son, that whosoever believes in Him shall not perish but have everlasting life." 有关圣经十六章讲说。啊，因为上帝听世间人，甚至将伊独死的子受死苦难，让每一个信义人通因为安尼人得得救。Oftentimes when we encounter a familiar passage, we tend to overlook some of the uh deep meanings that it carries. 啊，当咱对一个真正熟悉的经文啊，咱的点是咱大家袂记得。Uh, And some people, when they read John three sixteen, they think that because God loves us, He forgives us. Ah, so when many people read John three sixteen, they think that because God loves us, He forgives us. Ah, so when many people read John three sixteen, they think that because God loves us, He forgives us. Ah, so when many people read John three sixteen, they think that because God loves us, He forgives us. Ah, so when many people read John three sixteen, they think that because God loves us, He forgives us. Ah, so when many people read John three sixteen, they think that because God loves us, He forgives us. Ah, so when many people read John three sixteen, So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression of love is the giving of His Son. So the expression You see, because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, He cannot just overlook sin. Because God is holy, Is satisfied. Ah, this is kindness. Yes, is what I'm. 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 Which leads us to the third point: the sufficiency of the sacrifice of Jesus. The third point, let's go to the third point. The third point is that Jesus, with his sacrifice, with his sacrifice, with his sacrifice, with his sacrifice, so God loves us. He gave us his Son, and Jesus Christ offered his life to satisfy the justice of God. So, God, hearing us, will send his Son, Jesus Christ, to offer his life to satisfy the justice of God. 啊，牺牲伊家己生命，用来完全这个啊，上帝的的公义。Romans 5:11 says, "So now we can rejoice in our wonderful new relationship with God, because our Lord Jesus Christ has made us friends of God." 所以第十面在讲说，咱既然咱只要要，咱主要所祈祷，得力甲上帝和好咯。Notice the centrality and significance of Jesus Christ in that reconciliation. So, we need to look at the first thing. The first thing is the foundation of the Lord Jesus Christ. Romans 5:21 gives us a better understanding of this. Go, ah, go to the second chapter. So, we can see a little bit more about the sinner. So, just as sin ruled over all people and brought them to death, now God's wonderful grace rules instead, giving us right standing with God and resulting in eternal life through Jesus Christ, our Lord. So, we can see a little bit more about the sinner. So, we can see a little bit more about the sinner. So, we can see a little bit more about the sinner. So we have to understand that we are unable to save ourselves. So we have to understand that we are unable to save ourselves. And because God is love, He sent His Son. So the forgiveness of God is not based on His love, but rather the satisfaction of the justice of God. So we have to understand that we are unable to save ourselves. 
乃是借着耶稣基督所完成的来满足伊的公义。So when Jesus Christ came and died on the cross, ah,、uh, His sufficient sacrifice paid for our sins. 所以当耶稣基督啊来，然后为咱死，就是离家顶的时阵，这项代志就完成了啊，上帝公义。啊，会交给有这个充分的理由，行来啊，消灭啦。So how can God forgive anyone for anything？ 所以上帝要怎样我当啊，消灭任何一个人啊，无论伊所做的是项代志呢 ？Because Jesus Christ gave the sufficient sacrifice for our sins。因为耶稣基督啊，为着该去牺牲，伊这个牺牲。就真多有高雅的理由，行来啊，为咱为去赎罪。Let me illustrate it this way。我安尼用这个比喻来甲你解释。Say for example, you this is after the pandemic. Say for example, you went to a restaurant. 啊，耶耶稣啊，咱诶，这个疫情过了，你去一间菜馆诶内面食。And while Eating, you meet a brother or sister in the Lord. Ah, 当你来吃的时阵，你拄着另外一位主内兄弟姊妹。And that brother or sister goes to the cashier and says that he or she will pay for what you have eaten. Ah, 当这里啊兄弟姊兄弟姊妹，伊去到这个柜柜台的时阵，该讲什么？伊要就为着你所吃的底下退你付钱。So if the payment that he or she gave to the cashier is sufficient. Then you are no longer required to pay. 当这个兄弟也是准备为啊，按这个柜啊柜台所行的钱有交易，行来连你所吃的现现的现当交时，你就无需要搁再按因来现钱。So the question is, is the food free because it comes with no cost? 啊，这个就是讲说你所吃的呢，真侪是免费的，因为啊，完全免费的，因为。Obviously, we know that it comes with a cost, and the only reason why it is free is because somebody paid for it. Ah, 但咱知影讲说，这个是免费的，原因是因为有一个价值，一个所在。原因咱免现钱，是因为有别人已经替咱现了了。A lot of people cannot understand salvation simply because they think that. It's ridiculous to think that salvation is free. Ah, 真侪人无法能了解救恩这样代志，因为因真正莫名其妙，无可能受公说救恩是免费。So it is important that we understand that the reason why we do not pay for it is because somebody else paid the price. 咱就会明白公说，因为咱无需要为着咱的罪来付出呢，因为别人已经有人替咱付了了。And the sacrifice that was paid was the life of Jesus. 这个推难户的，就是耶稣基督本身将伊的生命也付出。So let me read Romans chapter five, six, eight, and ten. 所以咱过来读一遍第五章、第五章、第六、第八、甲第十章。Verse six says, "While we were utterly helpless, Christ came at just the right time and died for us sinners." Verse eight, but God showed us His great love by sending Christ to die for us while we were still sinners. Verse ten. For since our friendship with God was restored by the death of His Son, while we were still His enemies, we will certainly be saved through the life of His Son. The third chapter says, "Because we were yet blind, at that time Christ was sent to die for us, while we were His enemies." The fourth chapter says, "Although we were yet blind, at that time Christ was sent to die for us, while we were His enemies." The fifth chapter says, "Because we were yet blind, at that time Christ was sent to die for us, while we were His enemies." 而且，这得上帝惊的是，一定甲上帝和好。既然一定和好，就得搁较要因为因的生命得得救了。So for those of you who have not yet received salvation, understand that Christ paid the price so you can have this opportunity to accept Jesus Christ in your life. 所以，伫咱每一位也搁未接受啊耶稣基督的救恩的时阵，咱就一边甲讲说，耶稣基督一定啊付出了。And for those of us who already received this salvation, may this be a challenge for us, not only to understand the forgiveness of God, but also to express it so that we ourselves can reflect the life that embodies reconciliation. Ah, 对在，咱一定得救的人，咱得更加了解，讲说啊，上帝对咱的宽恕是怎样。啊！但系安尼，咱得要伫这方面来做一个表现，叫我当活出上帝耶稣基督的模样来。Understand that the message of the gospel 
is all about reconciliation and reconciliation is all about forgiveness. Ela ne bin ka kong chi ge hok in a kuan yi a kuan su a si long zong kuan yi he 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 ai he kai then now a he kai chi si a kuan yi a chi ge hok in. All of this is made possible through Jesus Christ. So I so with it che si ji nao in mi ya so ki to ge yan ko I hope that the more we understand God's forgiveness and experience it, the more we grow in Christ-likeness. So God bless and thank you for this opportunity to be your speaker.